Web development moves fast. Next.js for the front fast API. Five tones. Here's the best practice. This is the developer show. Let's talk about use effect. Use effect is one of the most powerful hooks in React and also one of the most misused. So when we should actually use it? We should use it when we fetch data from an API, when we set up subscriptions or intervals, or when we listen for browser events like scrolling or resizing. We should also use it when we're seeking external state like local storage values or URL parameters with our component. And then we shouldn't use it when we're updating local state after a button click. We don't need it there. We shouldn't use it when we're responding to props with a simple calculation. We can just use a variable instead. And in case we're triggering logic on render with no asynchronous side effects, no need it either. A lot of times use effect is a sign that we might be forcing React to behave imperatively instead of thinking in declarative flows. My rule, if we can express it through props, state, or pure functions, then don't reach for use effect. Use it when side effects are truly side effects.